Yeah, good morning. Mm, had a lovely breakfast. Made by me, not Sophia, because last time she made me breakfast in bed, she dropped it in the bed. Uh, yeah. So, you know, I'll make it myself now. I'm sure it was a lovely meal and all, and it would have tasted amazing, but... I prefer to eat another boy for the bed to eat it. You got a good thing going here now that you've reopened the mines. Don't let it go to waste. Um... The... Nelof and Tel is looking for a new steward. Would you... Like to be the steward or know someone who'd be a steward? <laughs> Gods, that's rich. Work for Nelof. <laughs> oh? Lover Mallory's the name. If you're looking for a smith, you found one of the best. Okay then, so what's we got for sale? <laughs> Gods, that's rich. Work for Nelloth. <laughs> I never... Either you're here to get showered in sparks, or you're looking for some... Take a look. Alright, the man seems a bit confused. He's just focused totally on Nelloth. Oh, that looks like a nice sword, but this. You know, not that brilliant. Compared to what I've got of fear already, it's not that good. Sell them all these weapons we picked up. Alright, so. Oh, yes, we need some corundum ingots to temper Sophia's armor for her. Bring your weapons and armor to me. There I'll was something I wanted right. to ask you. What? Would you rather have no gold and be good looking, or rich and ugly? Uh... I'd rather have no gold. <laughs> yeah, me too. I would hate being ugly, and I can just make gold on my looks. As long as I have enough of booze, nothing else matters. Okay, yeah, uh, that's not what I meant, but okay, um... Can I have your armor, please? Do I have a choice? Well, okay, but you owe me. I, I, I will give you it back better. I, I swear. Time to move, I guess. Uh, may I use your workbench? Steel, dwarven, ebony. If it's, I can mend it. Yes. Go. Did you want something? Yes, I got. Fine, but if you keep anything good. No, 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 no. I am. Fine, but don't take advantage of me. At least not in that way. Okay, Miko, I hear you. And if you give me... Yeah. Your old armor. And I'll quickly... Snatch the emotional disease. And... Yeah. There I'm glad that's sorted. You... Huh? I have some more things for sale now. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. I have some armor actually. Ugh, that stuff in bowl. And a spare ring that if you'd buy it back. I, I don't mind the loss, no. Don't worry. Bring your weapons and armor to me. I'll fix it up right. 
Hey, little Sophia, I fitted the armor for you. Now it should fit. The last man who said women belong in the kitchen and should go back to their knitting. Soon at his words when I punched him into oblivion. I think he must have been eating soup for quite a while after that. And I bet it wasn't a woman serving it. <laughs> oh, no need to worry, Sophia. I do the cooking here. Thankfully. Oh, hello, Miko. Mm. Now. Oh, yes, I had to find the steward from Vanilla. Um. Do you know anybody who wants to be a steward for now? I'll give you misery. Try getting a sign to scrape net scum off the front of the bulwark. Uh, it's just asking for something to work for Nelof. Okay, this man must really not like Nelof. Let's try the end. Uh, maybe Geldus will know someone. Um, well, we can start here, so... Hello. I work for Mokro. You got a problem, you talk to him. Okay. I'll give you this warning only once. Stay out of my way, and we'll do just fine. Uh, it's actually looking for someone to be the steward of Telmifrin. <laughs> Not on your life. I'd have to be truly desperate to do that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mokro doesn't lend coin to outlanders. Look somewhere else. Oh. Teldrin Cerro, Blade for Hire. If you have the coin, I'm at your service. Uh, no thank you, I was just... Mephalak Lokyu. You probably won't be a steward, um, hello. Working on those standing stones feels like a bad dream. I'm glad you woke us from it. I'm actually looking for someone to be the steward of Telmifrin. Um, you mean leave Raven Rock for good? To go work for a crazed Telvani wizard? Sure. Just let me get me things. It would not be too okay. second thought, never mind. I but, can get new stuff. What? The, the, I, well, you mean you actually want to go? Well, I've never been one to pass up an opportunity. Sorry to run, but I'm off to my new job. Nope. Okay. Well, he seemed to be awful eager to get his new job. Now we should head back to that Dwemer ruin. Actually, did the priest have any healing spells for sale? Excuse me. You may have everyone fooled, but I see what you're doing here. The call of gold sends you scurrying like a rat. Oh. Excuse me, but the temple is for followers of our fate alone. Outside the people of Skyrim have welcome. very dirty minds. I say the most innocent of things and they all get the wrong idea. I suppose you're a bit like that as well. Mm, maybe there's some more reasonable priests inside the temple. Hello. Are you here to pray? Or perhaps pay your respects at our ancestral tomb. Um, uh, no, sorry. I was just looking for a priest to sell me restoration spells. Nope. Okay, thank you for your time. Azura, Mafala, and Boethia guide you. Well, thank you. Uh, may not be my taste, but I thank you for your kind words. I need the shrines to. Princess. Okay. Is anybody down here? Nope, that's someone's room. So that that must be the no point in going there. Elder Arthroloth is grooming me to be his eventual replacement. 
Oh well, no spells for me. Not that I'm worried, the spells I've got seem to be doing the job, so it's not that big of a deal. Give up with the whole it never makes a difference. I can yell, I mean, you know, harm as many times as I want. What is this? Heal out! Perhaps you never heard me say chill out. Chill out! Yes, there we go. Well, you lot just out. You've obviously never met me, otherwise you would be cowering right now. Now what was somewhere around here? Ah, there's that hut we were at. Hope all of right. If you got that's one of these furnace dragons. Chug. You don't look so tough to me. You're right, Sophia. Hello, I mean you no harm. Oh, solid. I do mean you harm, so just chill out. Yeah, do better than that, will I? Does not seem anywhere near as good as mine. They had some good stored up though. How 
much gold you have. It's about how much of it you spend on me. It was a joke. Honest. Although, I wouldn't mind a new dress or maybe a necklace. Well, if we find anything here, Sophia, I could give it to you. Though I doubt the two ever have any dresses lying around. They might have jewelry lying around, though. You have a lot of jewelry on me, anyway. More than enough jewelry for you to wear a new one every day. Right, come on, on the elevator. Good, Miko. Come on, Sophia. That's it. you're enjoying it so does that mean the next gate is open let's go see what we got for you Sophia I have been told that I have one of the nicest voices in Skyrim or even Demiel for that matter Not attacking us, so let's leave it be. Oh, these funny gems. Should take that to the left. Alright, so. Luckily, we have enough gems for that, so let's go. I wonder how many more rooms there is to go. So, Sophia. Miko! Come on, you silly dog. Right up there, Sophia.
Yeah, how would you like that? So you can kill this thing before I can save Sophia. Okay, coming, Sophia. you don't really notice. Speaking of which, I'm getting a little thirsty. No, I know what happens when you get drunk. Seems the final guardian is already dead. Twelve made bow here and some weird arrows. And gold, solid gold ingots. This is where I guess they watched over the trials. Same as mine, but I'll try it out for a while. See what. Not like I've ever used a bow anyway, but. Make sure that Stuart arrives safely. Uh, we don't want it to be he took the path there but killed by these things as well. But it 
it's important to let people know that you are superior. It's for their own good, otherwise they would have no one but the gods to admire. Uh, well, well, yes, I suppose that is true in its essence. We have Hello? come south to test our worth against the mighty Netch. Will you join us? Um, well, uh, I need to test out this bow anyway, so I'll join you. Well met, friend. May we all fight or die well. Fight okay. Here, you won't leave here alive. Chill out, Nechi. Where did that guy go? <laughs> um, wow. Are you alright? They will sing stories of this day. Your friend is dead. Well, we may as well take the food. No, there's some arrows stuck in here still. Okay. Wow, I like fire those arrows really fast. It, it is like a like they got shot out of well, with telekinesis rather than a bow. Not sure if it's the arrows or the bow did that. I just took any arrow I can find out of my quiver. It was not even fuzzy, I was just fire more came out of it. Poor scow would have known. Fence, but you're not looking so good. Are you feeling ill? I'm fine. What are you good for sale? So, you wish to master the arcane arts? Uh, no, I wish to sell you my junk. Look, go. Really, I, I'm just giving away these spell tomes. And Until next gems. time. Why does everyone keep telling me I look ill? Oh, cure these potions just in case. Hello, no. Back so soon? I found you your new steward. That Drovus man? I suppose he'll do. He makes dreadful Canis root tea, though. But I should be grateful. Here, take this for your efforts. Oh, and you may use my staff enchanter if you want. Thank you. Staff enchanter. What's this thing? Let's have a look at it. I could make a you know, staff for turning undead or staff for healing. Okay, that's nail to make a staff of healing. But no, it's not needed, so. I'll end my diary here, and then we're heading back up to Scala Village next to see old Hermes Motor. And. Ugh. <sighs>
hopefully we could get an end to this Mirak fellow. See you then.